Peace be upon you. My name is Muhammad. Welcome to your Modern Country Farm channel. Come with us to learn about the corn plant. What is the corn plant? Corn is a type of plant, and it is the third most important crop in the world after wheat and rice. And its original home is southern Mexico and Guatemala, and the Native Americans used it as a source of flour, then European colonists spread it throughout the ancient world, and corn is the most important crop in the United States, and one of the most important countries produced in addition to the United States, China, Brazil, Mexico, Argentina, India, France, and Indonesia. Corn plant gel around me reach a height of more than 2 meters, a plant mono housing has flowers male and female separate and bearing flowers male inert plant summit while flowers female appear when armpit leaves, and carries this plant usually between cuz 1 to 3 cuz and, often just one cob. In order for the corn crop to grow properly, it needs a completely sunny and somewhat hot atmosphere, and the soil must be well drained, and organic fertilizers are usually used in order to make the soil as such. The corn grains are planted in lines, grooves, at a depth of 3 cm under the soil and it must be the distance between each grain is about 10 cm, and maize is usually planted in early spring, after the danger of frost has passed, and it takes approximately 90 days to become harvestable, but if the weather in the area where the grower lives does not last sunny and hot for 90 days, then that looking for fast growing varieties, he finds it at the cellar, and as a matter of knowledge, fast growing varieties of corn need 70 to ripen and are more resilient to cold. And after the corn seedlings emerge from underground, the ground is paved with organic materials as leaves trees, for example, and this helps the soil to remain moist, and the grower does not have to but put these materials on the soil under the plants, and the organic fertilizer is added four times in the growth stages of the corn, and it is added the first time before planting the seeds or seedlings and then added again when the seedlings reach the height of 25 centimeters, then when it reaches a height of 45 centimeters, then when the corn cobs appear, and the corn cobs are harvested when their outer shell becomes dark green, and for most varieties this is 20 days after the appearance of the corn cobs. The types of corn. Grown corn. Corn sugar. Corn flour. Popcorn corn. Corn is considered one of the feeds provided by the livestock farms with energy materials, due to the high value of the energy unit of feed, as this feed can be used on three types of green fodder provided to livestock directly after being packed in the form of corn grains, which can be relied upon when fattening. It's used for human food and other industrial purposes. Dot corn can also be preserved by slugging, as this method enables the provision of green fodder in dry periods during which it is not possible to produce green fodder, which plays an important role especially in raising dairy cows and goats. It is corn diseases. Corn rust. Downy mildew. Corn stalk rot. Corn cob rot. There are also insects that feed on corn plants, including European corn borer, Western corn rootworm, Northern corn rootworm, Mexican corn rootworm, corn stalk borer, from the corn leaves, corn cobs worm. The benefits of corn. The benefits of corn for health are very numerous, and this is due to its rich content of beneficial nutrients, and here are the details. 1. Promote cardiovascular health. 2. Protection from anemia. 3. Promote digestive health. 4. Supplying the body with energy. 5. Skin and eyes health. 6. Enhancing immunity and preventing cancer. The nutritional value of corn. Corn is a rich source not only of starches and calories, but a rich source of the following. Vitamins from vitamins, such as, vitamin A, vitamin E, and B vitamins such as niacin and thiamine. Of the minerals, such as, iron, magnesium, copper, phosphorus and zinc. Digestive breasts, and some of its digestive problems. Antioxidants that may have a role in preventing Alzheimer's in some cancers. Thank you for following you. Support me with a subscription and pressure on the bell. Bye.